Breaking news, an incident has taken place at Manchester Airport in which a man who was restrained by the police for committing a crime was at the receiving end of what is being considered to be police brutality. Now, I'm not going to play the video because of community guidelines, but if you really want to go and see it, you can head over to Twitter. But it involves steel toe cap boots of the policeman and the head of the individual that was on the floor. He was restrained and he was no longer a threat to anybody around him. Now, the police have put out a statement saying that the man was involved in some sort of a crime which maybe he was, maybe he wasn't. We'd have to see when the evidence comes out. But the question is, this man was on the floor. He was no longer a threat and he was restrained by the police officers. So why did this other police officer see him on the floor and feel the need to run up to him and treat his head like a football? The public aren't really concerned with the crime that this man has been arrested for as people commit crimes all the time. And maybe if he did commit this crime, then he deserves some sort of a punishment. And the public needs to know what the procedure is in these kind of situations. Is it okay for the police to take the law into their own hands? Is there going to be an internal and external investigation into the matter so that the public can feel safe, safe from criminals and safe from the police? People need to know so that we know where we stand.